There are no passengers in Doug Adcock's Autotech class at the Legron Academy. Be sure you get into the bottom of the cylinder. If you're in here, yeah, I, you're gonna work. Yep, keep going, you're good. And you're gonna get your hands dirty. We do do classroom stuff. I don't keep them in there. You, you can't learn this stuff in a classroom. You have to have your hands on. You have to drop wrenches and you, you know, you gotta skin your knuckles up. That approach can lead to mistakes. If you're not making mistakes, you're not learning. But it's the way Doug handles those mistakes that makes his lab special. Right, yeah, just flatten those out. He literally knows just about everything there is to know about a Ford. That's what I would do. So much so that Ford recognized him as one of the top mechanics in America, not once, but twice. But he never lets that big time status get in the way of teaching his kids. Every time I'm in this class, it feels like even if I mess up traumatically, it's just another day learning. He's wanting to help you learn. He's wanting you to like be able to do it yourself, but he knows how to make you not feel like an idiot. So it makes you want to keep like actually trying. That's how I learned. If I had a trouble at the dealership that just ate my lunch for two or three days, I never forgot when I finally fixed it, what the feeling was like. And I never forgot that problem. If it's completely out, you got a bad lead. Understanding how things really work has led to a lot of success for Doug's students. We have placed six kids last year. They're, they're now in Ford dealerships. It's also led to something that goes beyond being great with a wrench. My confidence raised. I never thought I could be able to do this. I thought I could work in an office, but now I just feel more confident about it with friends and then Doug helped me a lot. Doug has really showed me that there is plenty more to learn and I'm, I'm eager to after being around him. And for Doug, that's the most important fix that happens in his class.